Hello everyone, welcome back to the next update on the Orc City. I wanted to show you that I have finished the Colosseum sort of arena thing. I don't, I don't know, I wouldn't call it a Colosseum, but more of an arena. Anyway, uh, when you walk in, you can just walk straight into the arena because I figured the Orcs are, I don't know, they have pride. They, they don't give a crap. They want to fight. It's fun. It's games. So, or you can follow the spiral staircase around. And you have seats up here with, I don't know, some safety. Not so much on this side, but some on this side. I added a few things on the inside to make it, you know, kind of so if the sun was directly over, there'd be shade or whatever. So, I mean, roughly, this is, this is what we're looking at here. It looks about this way on each side. I, uh, I like the, the steps on the outside really make it look kind of like it's built on a foundation into the ground. But anyway, alright, so I started with this. I don't know if I'm going to keep this. I think I probably will because I have plans for this area of the dock. But this is where I'm at. Don't mind this circle here. That's just me goofing around. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It's okay. I, I, I don't like it, but I don't hate it. Uh, I, I want to wait until I put stuff actually on the dock so I can see what's up with it. You know, I don't know how how the finished product looks. Still need to do the inside of that place. Haven't done it yet. I did add more to the right, and I made the ramp like I said I was going to. Finish the bridge across the top. Put all these, I don't know, support construction things in. And I made the path that would follow, or you would follow all the way across over here to... Well, there's a bridge that will lead over to where all the uh, markets stalls are and, I don't know, entertainment and stuff. Which reminds me, let me fly on over here. I forgot to show you what's next to the Coliseum. I just had this random idea to add an archery place. Because I figured, why not? I guess orcs should know how to archer. Ar yes, they should know how to archer. They should know how to shoot bow and arrow anyway, so... I might as well put it here. This one's closer than this one, obviously, that's in the back. Uh, so, let's go over here. Well, I guess that kind of worked out, because now we can walk across the bridge. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Anyway. Alright, so the path also goes underground over to here, which I made a sort of prison area. Uh, and I, I want to keep it kind of dark. If you're wondering why I use the redstone, I like the lighting. It's, you know, not overpowering like the regular torches. Uh, and we have some jail cells sitting around here. Just, just little spots. And then I have this sort of uh, open area where if they if they had more than what, what could be in those cells, this would be it. And there's water here. And then a giant lava pool. Because, I don't know, thought it looked kind of neat. But it's all dug out under here. Uh, I wanted to, I don't know, give, you know, the the, uh, the prisoners should have room to run around. But if you, as you can see up top, there's a fence all the way around it. So if they were to try and climb and get to the top, it'd be pointless. And then they'd risk falling down to their death. I don't know, it made sense to me. If it rains, they could hide under here. Yeah, just that sort of stuff. So I guess now we can head out up here. I can flip around and show you the top section, what I have so far. This is where we're at. I essentially put, like, the fence around. Uh, I just thought the spikes look kind of neat, and they fit orc uh, architecture, I guess you could say. So, I've added them to the fence. It looked really plain without them. Uh, these down here, I have bunkers, a forge, blacksmith hut. I guess not really a hut, but blacksmith area. So I guess we'll go in bunker, I'll show you. I haven't put anything in the chest yet, but craft bench, furnace, the beds, and I put the little step so they could see out. I actually like the way these turned out. The bunkers look... Oh, what the... Except I'm going to fix that right now before I forget. Add that back in. And we have the path. The path I, of course, had to put random bits of sand inside of it and over it and stuff so it looks like, you know, I don't know, the wind blew and the sand's on top of it or, I don't know, the path's just breaking down and it's becoming real sand or something. It's a mushroom shop! Yeah! 
<laughs> this actually looked really plain here, and I couldn't think of something to put. So I figured, food! Why not some type of food, or plant, or something? And soldiers that might be in here could be like, Well, oh, I'm kind of hungry anyway. I'm gonna go down to the gas station. Except it's not a gas station, it's a mushroom shop. Anyway, uh, random torches. This is my forge. I actually like the way this came out. I'm pretty happy with it. I like the spikes. I, uh, I, I tried to challenge myself. I wanted to do them a little bit bigger, but this is how they came out here. But here we have our forge with tons of lava and fire and stone and just the way you thought a, a forge would be. So, I guess the la last thing, the next thing, is the blacksmith area for guy. I gave him some nice flower boxes here with mushrooms because blacksmith I don't know, I'm pretty sure they tend to be somewhat wealthy because they're in charge of making all the, the crazy stuff. And he has a nice little chair here with matching actually I don't know if that's that's technically not matching. I might have to No I can't because Well anyway, there you go. Matching chairs with a random table. Something like that. All these forges and and knives and crafting tables and I just like this painting. I think it's very appropriate here. But anyway. Kick ass bed and Oh yeah, more painting. That's this this is self defense though. If someone comes in here you can grab that stuff and kick their butts. Uh and various chests. I don't know. Really simple in here. Oh and stone floor, stone you know, typical I would think orc sort of structure. So let me fly on out here and I'll spin around and give you... Let me do... Wait. Uh, time day. Yeah, there we go. Flip around and I'll give you guys another glimpse. And then that will be it. This would be the upper tier. I still have plans. I think I'm going to put some type of barracks here and then more bunkers. I'm pretty sure. I don't think it's going to end up with huts and stuff. But that's that back there. And then the arena... The dock and the bridge. But yeah, this is where I'm at so far, and uh, I guess I'll make another video when I get a little bit further. See you then.